Beekeepers should perform regular hive inspections at least once a month. Hive inspections are done to continually monitor a colony's health, productivity, and temperament. Doing so will provide many insights into the queen's production, food stores, and apiary pest pressures so the beekeeper will know if any measures or corrective actions are required. Hive inspections require looking at every aspect of the hive and being thorough will pay off in the end. To begin, it's best to avoid approaching a hive from the entrance side. Begin by smoking the entrance, then cracking open the lid with a hive tool and give a few more good puffs. Make mental notes, even while doing an initial smoking, of how your bees are reacting to your presence. It will be normal for a more than usual amount of bees to now be flying around, but they should not be acting overly aggressive, stinging your suit, hands, or equipment. Using a hive tool, pull out and inspect each frame with your back to the sun to get the best light. It is common, but not always necessary, to check the frame furthest from you first. Going down the line, pull out each frame, making observations, and keeping them in their original order. Repeat this process until you have checked all frames. Your objective during the inspection process is to 1. Locate and inspect the queen. Make sure she is healthy and active and not showing any signs of sickness. Make sure the workers are tending to her. 2. Check the combs for eggs, larva, and pupa to see if the queen is producing healthy brood and her laying pattern is solid and uniform. 3. Check the combs for pollen stores and honey stores. 4. Check the comb for queen cells and remove them. 5. Check for excessive drone cells. 6. Check for surface pests such as varroa mite, beetles, and wax moths. 7. Check for signs and symptoms of diseases, such as nosema, chalk brood, and foul brood. Colonies are constantly at risk of becoming infected by disease, pests, swarming, or becoming Africanized. So it is up to the beekeeper to be able to recognize these signs and take necessary corrective action in a timely manner. Just like any form of animal husbandry, owning a honeybee colony is a continuous responsibility and it is up to you to maintain it.